636 is going to be a busy weekend, of course. Cookouts, friends, and lots and lots of, well, planes and automobiles. Yes, set to be uh, one of the busiest travel weekends we've seen since the pandemic. Our Kathy Hernandez live at the big airport. And Kathy, people are uh, itching to get away. We understand you have some numbers to share with us. <laughs> there you go. You said it all. It is busy. If you're traveling this weekend, be prepared for it here at Bush Airport. This holiday weekend is supposed to be the busiest travel weekend since the beginning of the pandemic. And we're seeing that here at Terminal A at Bush Airport. Travel is up here in Houston. Bush and Hobby Airports are expected to see nearly 900,000 passengers June 30th through July 5th. That's still down 16% from before the pandemic in two, uh, 2019. Yeah, the TSA says more than 2 million people went through airport security checkpoints this past Sunday. It expects to see even more travelers this July 4th weekend. Travelers we spoke with here at Bush Airport say they actually expected the holiday rush. Uh, travels travel. I mean, I, it's busy. What can you expect on the holiday weekend? Did you expect it to be this busy? I did not, but luckily I think I'm good though. I should be good, hopefully. If not, I'm gonna have a lot of uh, uh, angry people, for sure. What do you think about this long line for security, though? Yeah, it's a little bit rough, but we'll deal with it. They won't leave us. I'm sorry, what'd you say? They won't leave us. <laughs> they actually might leave them, though. <laughs> It'll be busy on the roads, too. AAA expects more than 43 million people to travel by car, more than even before the pandemic. Beware, though, gas prices are up, and Houston expects to pay about 260 a gallon. But we checked, and in other parts of the country, expect to pay 50 cents to a dollar more per gallon. So give yourself plenty of time to get here to the airport. Extra time here at Bush because of roadway construction to get to the terminals. And a reminder, of course, here at the airports, COVID precautions are still in place. You what must wear a mask inside the airports and on the planes. Happy July 4th weekend. Reporting live at Bush Airport, Kathy Hernandez, KPRC 2 News. These people catching a nap, too. It's one of those weekends. <laughs> All right, Kathy, thank you.